Okay. So our next goal will actually be. Thanks, Los Hermanos. No, it's not Los Hermanos. Well, we get there. We got, we're gonna go visit Ricketts. Apparently, Ricketts is alive. You have no idea how excited I was when I saw that. Alright, horsey. What's happening? There is a couple of towns I still need to save here. Wait, that's a safe zone? Oh, it's Ricketts. I mean, Ricketts is better than John. I like both characters, honestly. Come on! Stop swerving right! Or Come left! On. Or any direction that I'm not trying to go! I don't know why you just went yeah. through the railroad there. Come on! Come on! Oh. Let's go. Can we talk about why the map is trying to get me to go the opposite direction? Like, what? Mr. Ricketts. Hello, sir. How have you been? As you imagine. Good. Did you get the dynamite? Yes. Mm. And the bait. Huh. Let's see. for a soft touch. Not the brutish hands of a man of war, but the delicate touch of an artist. Some uh, use oils, and some a chisel and a block of marble. For me, sir, it uh, was always either high explosives or the trigger of a fine iron. But it's much the same. Sometimes your humility overwhelms me, Ricketts. <laughs> you and me both, Mr. Marston. Now, if you'd have seen me when I was a young man, if you'd have seen me when I was so fast, you couldn't see me. Well, then you'd know this is humility. The truth is, well, the truth is long dead. Now we got only memories. Memories and a great swath of demonic mutants, of course. <laughs> Have you heard anything? I heard a man in Chicago was writing a biography of me. And can you believe it? An artist in Pittsburgh painted my portrait. I mean, the demonic hordes. Not your own unending glory. No. <laughs> that. Nothing too interesting. Someone said that there's some really big problems near Escalera. But I can't concern myself too much with that. This is my home now. This, and this up here. Take care of yourself. I will. I don't think getting savaged by some brainless corpse would do too much justice to your myth. <laughs> yeah, I think you're teasing me, Mr. Marston. But I thank you. 
And I appreciate your concern nonetheless. traditional stat check. We're at 55. I think I was at 50% survive starting this. Um, so what I did try to I forgot about those challenges. Um, the sharpshooter is five undead sniper kills in eight seconds. I'm All right, horse. The sisters need our help. Come on. And I feel like the main story doesn't have much Whoa. luck to it as well. Come on. Yeah. So let's go to uh, uh, get Agave Fierro first. That way we can knock out another city. Yeah. The game's doing it again to me. I know it's because I'm not on the road, but if I take the road... Yeah. That may work, right? But did we already save the town that goes straight to the train tracks? I don't remember. Let's go! So game, why not just take the train tracks? Instead of, you know, going up and down the freaking hill to it. Uh, well you don't listen to us. Come on! Come on! We gotta go around all these mountains, don't we? That's kinda lame. Cause we're without trying in it back in Los Hermanos.
it works, makes me happy. I definitely need some ammo though. Alright, another town saved. Come on. Let's go back to the sisters, see if they have anything good for me. Señor Marston, how wonderful to see you alive. I think I've cleared Sepulcro. You're a brave servant of righteousness. I've been called many things in my time, but never that. <laughs> Who is that girl, by the way? She? I don't know. She said she was in a holy order in Escalera. I'm sure I keep seeing her. Or someone like her. Maybe. But it is a common enough look. Seemed like a nice girl. She told me something interesting. What's that? She blamed this terrible curse on our soon-to-be president, Abraham Reyes. Perhaps you have heard of him. Heard of him? I know him well. I hope that vain, ambitious, and repugnant parasite is no friend of yours. Not exactly. I didn't think he was that bad. And who am I to judge? Forgive me. I have just heard many unpleasant stories, and met too many pregnant and abandoned girls. Of course. But what has he done? She claimed he had angered an ancient goddess, disturbed a crypt, and a temple in her honor. <laughs> I mean, as I say it, it sounds like heresy. Like the idiotic delusions of a cursed people. But in a land such as this, I have learned to be less dogmatic than maybe I have been instructed. I am sure it is just folly. Perhaps. But maybe it's time I go pay El President a visit anyway. I shall pray for you. Someone certainly needs to. Goodbye, Mother Superior. Vaya con Dios, mijo.